like hard plugs. <laughs> I'm ready. Are you ready? Get ready. <laughs> it's Zero Page Homebrew. Hi. Broadcasting live from Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. It is. And I'm James and... I'm Darcy. And we're going to play some games today, specifically homebrew games. Hence the title of the show. I think I could bring this in a little bit further. Sorry. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, this is Zero Page Homebrew where we play a homebrew game, specifically Atari 2600 programs for now, games for now, until I um, run out. upgrade. Run out. <laughs> yep, that's an option. <laughs> run out of games. But I just got a whole bunch of new games. Oh, ho, nice. ho. look at these new games. Um, and some new cartridge games as well. Cartridge only. Um, but I have an unboxing video coming, so you'll be seeing those in the unboxing video. Um, but I want to upgrade my Coleco and Intellivision to RGB so that we can play some of Do those. This. Yeah, just like the Atari 2600, so it has really nice output. So it doesn't look like, you know, ass ass and garbly waviness, wobbly wobbly interference, like unpleasant ass. Nobody wants to look at an RF out signal. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> there was a time when we wanted to and that yes. time has passed. Long past. Now we paid, demand paid our dues. 1080p 4K <laughs> out of our 2600 games. <laughs> at least upscaled. <laughs> uh, so we have three games today and the games are um two of them are works in progress um uh, one is i think done ish i don't know if it's like completely done but i'm not quite certain it is uh the first one is carrot kingdom um which is a platformer uh the next one is nexion 3d which is um action maze game i guess genre and the third and is 3d oh, 3d and the third one is on cartridge which i got in my latest bundle um <laughs> he's placing his coffee cup in a his normal <laughs> spot are you finished the coffee yep oh wow um the third one get it done <laughs> is fall down which is actually on cartridge there you go fall down of course it's seeing our faces and not focusing but that's okay here do it again i'll look away there we go it worked <laughs> i should take it off the faces but actually it works really well with the faces it's, yeah. it's mostly us yeah um so yeah we'll be playing fall down which is an awesome game is it awesome hmm. and it's two player head to head oh ding it's, it's, that seems like i'm gonna be sitting here not playing games for a lot of the time <laughs> but that wouldn't be any different than normal <laughs> but after a person wins in that one the game is over so oh. it starts again so it's not like oh you die and then i keep oh, going i was no. yeah i don't know it's anything about it apart from head. what the name suggests yeah yeah <laughs> mostly falling down mostly falling down yeah um and let's see what do i have here for announcements mm, just one um i'm gonna be at the portland retro gaming expo in october so hopefully you guys are going there too it's october a, october it's a huge convention biggest in north america i think for retro gaming mm -hmm. um i went to the vancouver one this past weekend um very small in comparison it's like a tenth of the size it's super small um and i will be interviewing some homebrew programmers um and distributors so if you're a programmer and you're going to be at the portland retro gaming expo um drop me a line um james at uh zero page homebrew.com or on any of my social media stuff you can uh, get a hold of me so you can let me know if you're going to be there i'm going to be interviewing uh john shampoo um, from Champ Games, who did Mappy and um, Super Cobra Arcade right, right. and a whole bunch of other amazing, amazing games. And he has a game coming out very soon. 
that I will be getting an exclusive first preview play of uh, soon in quotation marks. He didn't say when, mm. and I can't tell you which game, but um, it's awesome. And I played it a lot as a kid, so I'm very excited about that. Um, <laughs> Ultima? Yeah, no. <laughs> that would be quite an accomplishment on a 2600. Uh, make sure you have a lot of ROM and RAM on the cartridge for that one. It could be done. You could do it now with the... There's a lot of text. Oh my god, that'd be crazy undertaking. Crazy. A lot of ROM and <laughs> a lot of RAM. Well, you to have, keep your, track of you all have of to that. use your... What's the saving thing called? Uh, the Atari Vox Key yeah. thing? Yes. You would definitely have to use that hmm. and have a just a big old cartridge. Huge old cartridge. Uh, Dan AVC, I wish I could be at uh, PRG, PRGE maybe next year or in the future. Um, also, Daryl Spice Jr. is not going to that one because there is one in Texas at the same time. What? I know! Competing retro gaming <laughs> event. They're not retro. They're, they're mostly retro, but mm. um, yeah, and they're fairly far apart from Portland to Texas. So um, They used to be like a week off of uh. each other. So if they do that again... Who changed? I think Tanya and I... Who's to blame? It's hard to say. Is it? Because... Did they both change? Because if they, they didn't both change, then it's easy it's, to say. It's possible. <laughs> like, it can't be on a date. It would be like third weekend of blah, right? And this is like the third weekend of October, I think, for the Portland one. Uh... I don't know. They used to be So off, one of them but... has a specific date and the other has... Thir no, because it can't no, be... No, it can't be no, specific yeah. date. It'd be a Wednesday. Nobody yeah. would go. It'd be a weekend. It'd be a third weekend of blah. But that still leaves someone having changed their system. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I've, I'd have to look back. And I think somebody said um, that it was the uh, Texas one that changed. But... I don't know if I can believe Arena Foot. We'll see. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's that's my my thing, my announcement there. So if you're there, uh, let me know. And Suinator, hello Suinator, hello Dan ABC, hello Iasposta, hello Major Havoc. Major Havoc is the programmer for uh, Nexion 3D. So we'll be playing his game next. But first up, it is Carrot Kingdom. There we go. And we'll be playing version 0.8a fix, apparently. It's a fix, but 0.8. And we're going to be using the Genesis Arcade Power Stick. Oh, that's back. Yeah, there you go. Nope, nope, go down. Yeah, and then down. Yeah, that was it. That was the problem. Now, is there sound? Yeah. Care what Kingdom. speed should I have my Megafire set to? <laughs> you know, it's probably an option. <laughs> I don't know if this supports two buttons. Uh oh, three oh, lives. Three lives oh, left. Oh, that's jumping. Oh, I'm going to turn down a little bit. You got jumping. You got a little cat and you're a mouse there. I've played a little bit of this game. Still a little bit loud. And a little loud on the output here. Oh! And a carrot, carrot killed you. Cats don't kill you, but carrots do. <laughs> That's or right. Or do the cats kill you? Because that cat doesn't. That cat's all friendly. Yeah. Hello, Major Havoc. Hello, Lord Monkus. Howdy. Oh! Welcome. Kill it! Kill it with fire! What? Roast that. It's still coming. No, what, what fire? I don't know. <laughs> figure it out. Let me read the instructions. Actually... Technically, I looked. I looked through the forum for this one. Sometimes it's down or up to fire. Oh, or button and down. Holy and up. jump in. Pushing downs for shooting. Yeah, I actually looked through the the um, forum for this one, and there's no instructions. Um, it just it just puts the puts the game out there and says go at it. Um, but there's a lot a lot a lot of pages to flip through, so it's. I think the game is pretty much kill everything or everything will kill you. Hmm, I think that thing just tried to kill me. It took, I think you had three hearts to begin it with. It took a heart, yeah. And now you have two hearts. And now you're in the dungeon area. 
And more carrot patrols are coming after you. Wait, am I a mouse? Yep, definitely a mouse. And no, I caught it. I <laughs> you caught it with your heart. I don't know how I'm ever going to kill one of those things. <laughs> oh, fire. Yay! And it is a flickery, flickery mouse. Oh, Ginny is a cat girl. That's, that explains why the cat did oh, not kill me. Oh, it's a cat girl, not a mouse. Bread cat. Oh, bread cat's here to kill you. And he did. Successfully. And it's game over. I'll let you, do you want to do one more? Or you want to hand off? Because I have nothing to say about this. Because <laughs> oh, I have no, no stand information. Stand there and say nothing, man. Because I'm going to play again. Oh, I have something to say. Um, the first post, the first time this was released was three years ago. Two and a half. Um, so this is Carrot Kingdom by Jinro. Um, and in, he first posted about this game on October 9th, 2015. And this release is uh, 0.8A. And it was up, this was released on October 16th, 2017. So it's about nine months old and he hasn't done an update since. I saw a couple posts that he's been really busy and not able to update it. I don't know, can you get up that high? Uh, I caught it, I caught it. <laughs> Cut it with your mouth. Uh, Injuries. It's really nice fire. Really nice fire animation. Oh yeah, I was gonna say the um, the cat graphic is very flickery, and it's flickery. Oh. Oh, because he's using two colors in the same line. Oh, I have to start over. Actually, that doesn't explain it either. Because you shouldn't. Oh, that's interesting. Why is it flickery? Because the enemy's not flickery. And why would they choose the mouse to be flickery? Because technically, if you've got the mouse, or not the mouse, the cat. Haha, <laughs> I got it that time! And you got a heart. Yeah, but I didn't need it because I got it. <laughs> ah, <true. laughs> Every time I've gotten a heart, I haven't had a use for it. Um, cause it and the enemy isn't flickery. So they're dedicating more time to the enemies drawing than they are the cat, which is very strange. I would think that you'd want to dedicate all your um, sprite drawing power to your main character that's on the screen most of the time. Because it is doing two colors in a row. It's bread cat time and you've got all your health. Oh, you dodged that one. No, you didn't dodge that one. And you didn't dodge that one. one oh, left. I, oh, oh, and you're still on bread cat. Well, at least I get to fight bread cat instead of... <laughs> the whole level again? Yeah, every shot that you're shooting is hurting him. Yeah. Which I appreciate the uh, health bar a lot. <laughs> I do. Yes, it is, rather than not... Just sort of mystery. So what am I doing? Oh, there's like a lot of games. Random amount of time. Yeah, I know. I hate that. That it's like... Mm, I am can't stand still in the fight. Cannot stand I still. I did. <laughs> you did stand still? <laughs> no, it didn't work. I mean, I think what you're saying is you can't stand still and win. <laughs> ah, that's the key. In which case, I use, you have been proven correct. So. Okay. That cat is absorbing all the shots and not dying. Maybe it's got infinite health. It's probably your friend. I'm sure it's your friend. It was before you shot it like 20 <laughs> times. That's true. It's probably not so happy about me now. Oh, I hit its little stock and that killed it. Maybe there's someone on the ceiling here. Yeah. There you go. Got to jump up and get it. Yeah, that's what Fire's I did. Fire's really good. It's got a shadow. Yeah, cast down. the that's shadow is... That's that's impressive. Very, very nice animation. And good walking animation as well. And the fire from the ceiling is really good. And we've got a Tari! Come here, you. Hi, Tari. And you can escape. That's right. Get him. <laughs> 
And apparently I have the key right away for this dungeon. Didn't have to find it. Yeah. Which is helpful, I guess. Look out, that cat is made of bread. And I am vulnerable to bread. It is shooting it. Oh, whoa. Shooting its bready goodness at me. Yeah, the way it shoots out at you made me think that it didn't go in the same spot every time. <laughs> oh, okay. It tricked me. It was I was panicking so you. easily tricked. Oh, it got me on my <clears> foot. <throat> yeah. On your foot. Oh, purr, purr. Yeah, oh. I know. Oh, nice. Nice. Destruction. Hello, Thrust 26. Thomas Yanks. Yanks? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Terrible with that name. Yanks? You Yanks. Yents. Yents. That's it. Yents. Ah! Uh oh. Ah! Oh my uh -oh, god. Oh, you died. I died. Okay. This is so scary I gotta forest. shoot one and then shoot, turn around, shoot the other one. Oh my god. Yeah. It's difficult. OMG. OMG indeed. Ooh, I got it. Oh you my did. god. Hopefully there's not two again. And there is. I think that's the... Oh, God, uh, I got two of them. I think that's the... Uh, two of them is the challenge. Uh, in, that, in, that particular uh, one, you, in that particular one, you had to shoot the one behind you first. It was closer. Oh, was it? Yeah. That is hard. I should have thrown one at me at first. But I guess it's the, it would be the same as any of the other. Actually, no. It's only little things coming down at first. Those are real easy to kill. They're so slow. So slow. They're just carrot folk. <laughs> Simple carrot folk. They do have um, pokey sticks. Oh, they kill you. They kill you dead. She Actually, she looks pretty solid on the bottom. No, it's all flickery. It's all flickery. I just don't understand why it's flickery. Why they would do that. Interesting. It's funny that it has Where'd a little thing to the back. <laughs> Is he kicking you? Are you kicking Using him? me as a leg rest. <laughs> That's all you are, Tim. Oh, oh, kisses. All right, Cat Fred kisses. Cat. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. yeah, I know. Yeah, Come I know. on, you can do it. It's the last second jumping. There you go. Just do that every time. Woo! Using player zero twice for the main character. Yeah, I'm just not understanding why. Why they're using player zero twice. And making it super flickery. Like, even on this... Um, this fight, they're obviously using, um, Phew. the oh. play field for the cat. There's absolutely no reason that the, uh, that your oh cat my. should be flickering. Hi, mister. Stop it. Just I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. And I, and I think I read that this one was done in assembly. So they had full control. That's, those are <clears throat> tough. Full control over everything. They didn't have to use a predetermined. Oh, he is faster on the left. Still oh, but they tough. stay up high that that, that time. Uh, okay, so you got to jump and get them on the second one. Oh, Mr. Green Eyes, Mr. Green Eyes. And I know why they're doing it because then they can dedicate player one for the enemies. Because there's, they're just single colors. But if you do good flicker management, you wouldn't have to do that. <clears throat> but maybe he'll implement it um, in his next build. This one's like nine months old. So he has time. Lots of time. It would make it look so much better. Not that it looks bad. It's not. It's pretty fast flicker. So, hi, hello, hello, hi, Pixel. Baby. How are you doing? What's the complaining about? It's because cats are fighting cats on the screen. Oh. 
<laughs> ah! Oh no! The thing is, you can just hold down. Yeah, that's what I did. And just wait for, to jump. <laughs> not exactly the hardest boss, except for like... Oh, not that oh. hard, eh? He ran... I killed him! Well, you have to kill him again. I thought I'd killed him and I didn't have to jump. But... Oh no! The timing is challenging. <clears throat> I guess he is a bit. Well, the first boss bit. should not be unbeatable. It's not no. crazy for the first boss to be like a little something bit of a that challenge. you can figure out. That's true. Okay, I'm just gonna keep hitting. Nope, oh, there we go. Come on. Nope, 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 nope. Off the electronics. Yeah! Are you the naughty one? And now it's tough. But yeah. now I know a bit yeah. more. Oops. Oh, I got a heart. Good. Not that I needed it there. Okay. Uh oh. The problem with the enemies is that you have no reprieve after they take one of your health. What do you mean? Like, usually in games, you get a little bit of time. Oh, yeah. Between when you get hit and when you can get hit again. In this game, it's... It's like immediately. You you can go boom boom boom. All three health are gone. Hi. Oh god. What are you doing, Mister? <sighs> you see that? There was a ghost. Uh, that was a ghost. Ghost the kitties, of me. The kitties in this game only get three lives, not nine. Yeah. Only a third. Oh. Okay. Bye bye. Both of you. It's getting further. Getting a little bit further. I think there's four bosses in this game he has plans for. I don't understand why there are jumps in this part. Why there are jumps at all? Yeah. Is it just to make the terrain more interesting? Um, more interesting and to train you up, I guess, for when on the second level there are jumps, but jumps for a reason. Because there's gaps and you can die, like I did on my last life. There, you got the heart and I it got a heart actually and it did mattered. something. Yeah, you got one too, like that. That is true. It's very helpful. See, those guys die. The on problem one is, hit. the problem is that like, for the controls, yep. it would make. I don't, know. I don't know. Never mind. Ignore me. <laughs> it's just weird that would you, you pull down to shoot. It's yeah. Very, it, it's and up does nothing, right? Up does nothing. Yeah. So they could have done the fire button for shoot and up for jump. That's what I was thinking, but I don't know how much I would like that either. Sometimes it's better because there's a lot of jumping in this game. But there's also a lot of shooting, especially with the boss. I don't know which would be better. Obviously, the other he thing tried is, it out. Like, these gaps are... I guess you can make it. Yep. I'm not sure if I'm making it. Yeah, you yep. can make it. You, there's just like almost no space. Yeah, that would be the limit of the jumping. It's a good gate. Good looking gate. And a, a decent um, <laughs> enemy. Decent looking enemy for the size. Because usually you can't make enemies that big in 2600 games. Because the sprites are only 8 pixels wide. You can double it or quadruple those pixels, but then. But that is like a. takes up like know, almost half the screen. So that's a really big boss. Probably one of the biggest bosses I've ever seen in a 2600 game. <clears throat> why is it bread cat? <laughs> <laughs> why, why not? Why not bread cat? <laughs> um, that is an unsatisfying response. Do you think he's throwing bits of himself? Oh, those ghosts are relentless. I think he's throwing bits of bread at you. No, that one first. I tried to do that, <laughs> but like the jump, the the shooting is weird. Here's the me. hard one. Uh, it does push you back. It's just that when there's two of them, it pushes you into the other one. Right. So it's it's like pinball effect, causing. Super death. Super death! No. Dead. Dead, dead, dead. Dead all over. One more try. Unless I get really far. 
I don't mind the jump as the button. No, no, I like the jump as the button. Yeah. Whoa, what? Maybe I can get him hitting his... Maybe he was on a little down bounce or something? I don't know. I like uh, the little puff of smoke that exists after you get them. <laughs> that is nice. Yeah. Um, I like that feedback. It's more of a modern kind of uh, death. Yep. It is a hard game. Yes, I do agree, Thrust, Thrust, Thrust 26. Those ghosts are brutal. They should, I don't know. They kind of appear on the screen, don't they? Halfway, like, all of a sudden. Especially the right hand one. The ghosts, yeah. They, they, well, they, they are ghosts. That's true. They can come anytime <laughs> they want. They were there the whole time. You just couldn't see them because they're ghosts. <laughs> I think I read it's four levels. Four bosses. Or he plans to have four bosses. And this does say a demo, so it may not be the whole game. Maybe it's two bosses. I think this and the next game is also a demo game. Which is very rare to see 2600 games released only as demos, where you only get some of the game. Most programmers release the whole game. Are your bullets slowly drifting down? Oh, I don't know. Let me try it. Not that one, but before... When I was shooting the cat? Oh, yeah. It does come out on the left-hand side again. It's definitely going straight <laughs> across now. Bloop. Yeah, that is funny. There's a couple... There's a couple issues that could be... could be improved upon. Okay, got it. They appear at a, at a spot, so if I can... Do this and then... Okay. Now it's just the gap. Oh, what? Oh, I need that. What you One have to do is, when you turn, do a Hadouken. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like that, and then you will be you will Left be and down. Yeah. Left down and... Left, left jump and down. No, no. what you need for the floating ghost. Sure, but what I mean is down. Down left. Not, oh, down, you not can. left down. Down you can, left. You can yeah. do diagonals. Yeah, so you can say Thomas. <laughs> okay. Thomas. There, we said it. Left first, maybe. Yeah, definitely the left ghosts. Okay. I think I... What? Uh-oh. Bug. Bug. <laughs> Fix it. Oh, no, the beginning of the level. <laughs> That's the only way you're going to get better at killing those ghosts. Ugh, I did go left and down on that one. Oh, no! Still have one life. <laughs> You're so funny. Bug! <laughs> Why are you kill me? <laughs> You're so outraged. <laughs> Ow, this is an outrage! <laughs> it's a, it's a oh, that was a good one. It's a, in progress, right? It is. <laughs> so I'm not... Do not turn around on... You slip right through that hole. He pushed me back! That's what happens when you get hit. You get pushed back. It's your, oh. normally your saving grace. It's normally the thing that saved you. But here's Not the there. question. Can you move when you're falling? I bet you can. Or are you screwed? Just try it. Well, I'll have to wait a bit. Oh, you can no, jump. jump. Yep, you yeah. can. So you could have saved yourself if you'd realized you were had been pushed. Like, pushed and... You didn't realize you were pushed, but if you'd realized, you could have uh, tried to adjust back. Yeah. No. No? Okay. I'll do one more and see if I can make it past that that chasm. Seems like a chasm. Anyway. I just know I'm going to get to those ghosts and they're just going to murder me. <laughs> they and are we don't have time ghosts. today for me to, to, uh, well, to skill up beyond that. <laughs> they're mad that they're dead and you're not dead. And so they're jealous and they want to make you dead. Because as soon as they make you dead, do you notice they disappear? Or at least one of them does. Uh, they kind of jitter around the side of the screen. They're like, yeah, we got them! They do have a party on the side of the screen. They go... -lo 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 -lo. <laughs> <laughs> Screw that guy! I mean that lady. We hate cats! <laughs> cats are our enemy! Oh. How did you do it? Oh, With great right skill. at the edge. With a great skill. <laughs> great skill. Okay. I don't know if you can move left and right. Oh, you can. I don't know if that helps. 
Actually, it probably would. If I got closer? No. Oh, you just that's <laughs> how you absorb the damage. I went too close before. You shoot him quicker there, so you might want to go forward, shoot, 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 and then yeah. if you time it right. Not worth it. It's pretty short. Short section, anyway. I guess, you know, if, if you just want to waste your whole life, <laughs> you don't want to save any time. <laughs> I'm just saying, it would be quicker. True. Very. Do you get all your hearts back at the next I don't, I don't level? Hmm. I think you do. I guess they... Ah! They chop off the top of the cat slowly as he goes down. I guess that's so that you don't have to wait as long for it to disappear. Oh, yeah. I think so. <laughs> yeah, you did get your hearts back. Yeah, good. Is this two One sets of... Three. 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 Boo. No! Uh, I jumped. Okay. I like the ghost, by the way. I didn't notice how much it looked like your character as a ghost before. The... Oh, the death? Yeah. Okay. Like, oh, look. See, it looks... God. It's terrible. Yeah, it does. It's yeah. good. good ghost. It's like same face. Or similar face. It's not the same. Oh know. my god, that was terrible. Okay. Do you base your game selection on your guests or vice versa? <laughs> uh, no. I do. It is. I base guests. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> my co-hosts. <laughs> no, no. I just mean uh, like he doesn't care about his guests. He's like, <laughs> Whatever. You're here to do oh, a job. You play these games. You play. You play the games I give you. You'll play them and you'll like them. And you'll play them good. <laughs> or else. Obviously, I ignore that. Oh. If the mega fire. I'm gonna try the mega fire on this. Cheating. But it's just the jump. Oh yeah, so it's you don't not want the that. fire. Yeah, no. It no. wouldn't help you. So that was uh, <clears throat> hard. Carrot That's Kingdom. a hard game. A yeah, little... Although, hard, no, it's not that hard. The first level is not hard. No, the first level is not the hard. The first we level... got through pretty easy. I got there... I mean, I had to play it a few times. <laughs> <laughs> but I think your second time... But I did eventually get there. You and... beat it. Second time you beat the boss, I think. The second time I got to the boss, yeah. That means it's not a hard game, though. <laughs> because I, 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 I know uh, I, it's very obvious I'm not good at this game. So if I can beat the boss, it's not that hard. But it does get hard. Yeah, very yeah. quickly. Level 2 yeah. is super hard. Not impossible. It's just really, really difficult. Hey, um, bud. What are you doing? Oh, to go back to the question. Um, I... Meow. Meow, meow. Oh. Hello. Hi. Hi, Detective Face. It's a cat face. Meow. Um, I do somewhat tailor the game selection to the guests. Like if I'm going to play with Tanya, yeah, yeah, she likes puzzle games. Yeah, yeah. And and she what he's saying, puzzle games. he tailors the games to Tanya. Because yes. I like puzzle games too, but I don't get to play them <laughs> because all the puzzle games go to Tanya. <laughs> Benefits of being married, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Tanya. Oh. Well, she had to make the sacrifice. It's favoritism. Somebody had to marry me. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's about it. I think that's the only the only one that I go. I just have some puzzle games for Tanya, and that's about it. Uh, the rest, just random. Um, and the game selection is try and pair um, a cartridge game, like a released game, with two works in progress that usually works That's out pretty well now, yeah. i'm running out of actually i thought i would run out of cartridge games first oh i'm running out of works in progress <laughs> oh okay like i've depleted the list to almost nothing now i had a hard time finding the third game today um because a lot of them are like really rough early stages that are like not even games yet like you can't really even move <laughs> there's no character on the screen on some of them you can't shoot you just move around the screen you can't do anything there's no enemies um so yeah i'm running out so please send me information please about make games. more make more games quickly quickly by, by next Lickety week split. <laughs> <laughs> um but uh no there's options i mean we can play more released games but i mean those cost me like <laughs> sixty dollars a pop <laughs> for one third of a day it's not good i mean we do go back and play them again and complete them so but 
I mean, talking Canadian dollars, not not U.S. Yeah, real money. Like these are just the cartridges, are like twenty-five to thirty-five U.S. And the boxed ones are like forty to sixty, I hmm. think, depending on what's included. Yeah, so it does get uh, very expensive. Very expensive. Axion <coughs> 3D demo. demo. Okay. So it's got like 3D spinning. It's got a Nexion. It's bouncing a bit, which is not good. So it needs to fix that. See if you can figure out what's going on here before I read out. Aardvark has progressed a lot, a lot since my last test. Really? Has he released it? You may have missed it. I did do an updated aardvark. Um, do I have to shoot these things? Um, I'm not going to tell you yet. <laughs> I'm going to wait till you die. Or did you die already? I don't think so. No? Okay. So this is Nexion 3D by The Major Havoc, who was in the chat or is in the chat. It's quiet now. I think he was here in the beginning. Okay. So yep. where am I trying to the go? The Major Havoc is here. Um, okay, so this was originally posted. Uh, the first post about this was on October 27th, 2016. So this game's a year and a half-ish old. Um, it says, I've been working on some 3D routines for Zybot, still work in progress, and it has evolved into its own first-person shooter. And this version is from October 24th, 2017. Um, final demo, it says, three levels. So I'm guessing um, this is not going to get another... Oh, you did die. This is not going to get another demo release. So this is what we get till he's finished. And also, this game was demoed at Atari Age's booth at last year's Portland Retro Gaming Expo. And it will be included on the Retron 77, which is coming out in two weeks, which both of us are going to be getting. Retron 77. Okay. I don't know how to shoot is the problem. I know how to move. Actually, that is an issue I had with the game. But I will get to that. Okay, the game was changed uh, from... I'm dead. Changed to Nexion 3D from Berserk 3D. Uh, this was a decision to avoid any legal issues when we get into this into the cartridge format. Um, you're trapped on the planet... You can read it out. You're trapped on the planet Nexion with only a mapping unit and a blaster pistol. Find the key, then find the exit! <laughs> Nexion and Forcer Droids will hunt you down. If, if you hear noises, they are near. Use your blaster dis to dispatch them, but beware. Then Mazon generators will create more. Ooh. No. 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 Back. Back, Jojo. Bottom. Hardware key. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> to, 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 to. Gameplay instructions. Use up and down to move forward and backwards. Yeah. Oh, you can go back. Okay. Oh, you uh, can go back. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Left and right to rotate view. Use the compass for direction. Fire button and left. Fire button and left and right to strafe. Ah, okay. So you hold that and you. Ah, okay. okay. I'm straight. Fire now. button and down to fire blaster. Oh, down. Why would it? Why? Why wouldn't you just? Make what? It, why wouldn't you just make it the button? It's not doing anything by itself. Yeah. Like. No, it's fire button to strafe. You hold the fire button and. and yeah, but I'm not shooting. No, but you're. You the use strafing it. means shoot. And no, move strafing is like means you hold the right. button and then you go like this and you move to the side. I always thought strafing involved always a gun. No. Okay. No, strafing is your movement. You usually have a gun, and you do in this case have a gun. You're just not shooting it. I get why, because fighter jets strafe. But uh, fighter jets don't strafe the way that gamers strafe. Gamers strafe by going... <laughs> choo, 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 usually circling things. Like, yeah. this is the thing you want to kill, and you're going like this. <laughs> but <laughs> just this is strafing. <laughs> Oh, yes, they do a circle strafe. You don't have to pull circle the trigger. Strafe. Yeah. Okay. I mean, that's how you play Borderlands ah, 2 ah, anyway. Ah, 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 shoot. Okay, I think I got that guy. 
Continue. I know there's a key. You have to find a key. Ah! Ah! Okay, uh, use the fire button to pick up the key and to unlock the exit. Okay. I have not found a key yet. Um... I don't know if you get I'm, to... I think I saw the key. Like, that might be the key. No, that's moving. What? What is that, then? It's batty. But it's moving through the wall, so... I think you can see it through the wall. Like, what was the arrow that you saw? The hut. It looked like a hut. Uh, that was the guy, and he moved and got bigger and changed. Okay, that part I don't understand. And the like, enemy? And I don't... Instinctively, I don't understand how the enemy oh. see I just got like the enemy is in the same position but gets uh -oh. bigger and is closer that's your joystick oh there's the key oh I got it what <laughs> did I just get killed after I got the key you uh. get the key. Uh, use the fire button to pick up the key and unlock the exit use the map the instructions say to use the map so if you're not <laughs> using the map you're not following the instructions. <laughs> I am almost <laughs> exclusively using the map. The compass will show you your direction. So the compass is the top part. Right, yeah. yeah. When in proximity, your mapping unit will display the exit as a flashing blip. The what will display it as a blip? The map. The map on the bottom? The map on the bottom, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Once the droid that holds the oh. key... What the is exit that thing? Maybe that's the exit. Ah! Ah! Oh, now I'm half... Ah! Where is he? Ah! Run away! I've got one health left. Mm. Oh, is that your health at the bottom? Yeah, it goes at from 100, and every time you get hit, go to... I'm gonna die. Well, if you make it your goal... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to die. Once the droid that holds the, ah, you have to kill droids to get the key. Oh, no Once wonder I couldn't find it. Once the droid that holds it. the exit key is destroyed, it will also blip on the map. So once the key Look is at this. on, the, it's your joystick. You think it's my joystick? It's definitely your joystick. Your joystick is not centered very well. Twenty-four oh. levels of play. Twenty-four levels. Oh my god. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. So you do have to kill the baddies mm -hmm. in order to... So you have to seek out the baddies. Okay. Shoot them, shoot them, shoot them! Don't forget to strafe until you get them in front of you. Ah, oh, what's that? What is that? That I, Is that the key? That's, that's the exit. That's the key because you don't have the key yet and you need the key. Turn. Turn. Oh. There it is. Press your button. You okay. have the key. Don't and die health. now. Don't and, die now. <laughs> and health, which is good. Okay, now it's said that the exit would be on the screen. But but it's not on the screen. Dirt now looks more like dirt. <laughs> dirt oh, that's like, for Aardvark. Oh, Aardvark. Dirt looks like dirt. <laughs> sure does. Uh, when in oh, proximity, good. your mapping unit will display the exit as a flashing blip. So you have to get... Oh, in proximity. In proximity. Oh, this joystick is not centering. Damn it. That's what I said. I got ripped off. Did you just get it? Yes. But you, yeah. can, you can fix that. Um... Yeah, the screws are... Just pause the game. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. We'll switch. We'll switch um, controls. What game are we going to be playing? Fall oh, Down. We need to switch controls yeah. for that anyways. We need to plug in a second one for that anyway. Yeah, this... Damn it. Yeah, it's... It's st sticking up and down. And those other huge controllers don't work on this because they only use USB, right? Yeah, those are USB. And there's no adapter. You can't adapter. plug the USB into an adapter that plugs into this? You can adapt a 9-pin to a USB. Oh, but, but there's no the such around. thing as the other way. I actually looked because I have some very nice arcade huge ones um, that <clears> would work very well. Ah! 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 Shoot! Did I get him? Mm. I think I got him. I don't hear him. No. So... Oh, okay. one. Die, die, die. No, I'm almost dead. Oh, there you go. Good luck. I will need it. Good. Because <clears throat> we got the, I got the key so far. That's as far as we made it, so. Oh. 
Two baddies. Wait. Oh, when you hold the button and yeah, pull back? Yeah, that's, that's easiest, I, I found, is holding well, the button Well, because if you down. don't, when you pull back, you move back. Yes. <laughs> I must have got him. I think so. He disappeared. He didn't I, even touch you. My hit points didn't go down, so... Oh, I'm very excited to see new Aardvark um, builds, but I think it was implied that he wasn't going to... Shoot him! Shoot! Down and... Button, fire. Got him. Another one. He's in, there you go. Oh, it's over. Um, I think it was implied in the old, uh, in the forms that there's not going to be any more public uh, Aardvark builds. Um, I may be mistaken, but Ooh, there's a baddie. Come on, come to me. Come to me. There we go. Yeah, I have to say I do not understand the bad guy information on the screen. I don't know what's happening with it. He moves around. He's sort of in the center, but now he's like wiggling. Is yeah. that him dancing out of the way? or Is, is he dodging? And, is that what's happening? And when you see a house, what is that? Is that just a representation? Is it like your the, HUD? It's like, oh, there's a bad guy nearby and he's kind of in front of you. Yeah, uh, that's how I'm taking it. Where he's not quite in front of you. He's near you. It would be easier to understand if it was further away somehow. I don't know. It's weird that it, that the information is... Sometimes like it's that, because right? he's right in front of you. Yeah, it's and sometimes his legs. It's his little legs there as a hut. Right, but... I guess I don't understand what I'm seeing. <laughs> he's just further away. That's far away. That's medium with the legs. Oh, Are you walking? No, I'm not doing anything right now. No, I mean, is your character walking? Is that like a person that's walking? I thought you were in a car. Oh. And oh. I, I, was looking at, I was looking at the view totally oh different God, here. Oh my God, this is hard. <laughs> I, I think, it's the think I understand though. now. Okay. Partly so the what I'm seeing now... Yes, further away. Okay. I get it now. <laughs> I was not seeing... I was seeing... Never mind. I was just seeing that as like... I was looking at it wrong. I wasn't looking at it at in like the uh, Ultima 1 dungeon 3D perspective. For some yeah. reason I was thinking it was just a zoomed in perspective. Oh. I no, get it now. He's further away smaller, then he gets bigger, and then bigger. Yeah, I get it. It and, totally makes sense And now. is he dodging when he goes to the left? I'm the dummy that didn't get it before. I get <laughs> it okay. now. Yeah, because he walls are further away. Yeah. And they get closer. And it seems that you can see them through the wall. Yeah, it looks like he's dodging. It's better to hold down the button and then press down, I find, to shoot. There you go. Oh, it does look like he's dodging. Yep. Yeah. Because you don't hit him when he goes to the side, and you do hit him when he's straight on. This is a really different way of showing 3D. The only the only thing the thing oh getting smacked. Like it works. It totally works. And the directional thing, it's like having all your information split into three segments. Because without that direction you're facing, that would be hard to figure out what's happening. Because you'd have to keep experimenting and have to remember which direction you're facing. Because the map at the bottom of the screen doesn't show which direction you're facing. Oh! Um, not that it couldn't, it totally could show which direction you're facing on the bottom because instead of like a block on the bottom, it could be an arrow because you definitely have, I thought I found the key, but I guess not. You definitely have a player, <clears throat> a player one and player zero still available on the bottom. Um, cause I'm guessing that's, that can be done by, um, a ball. See, one thing is that the missile I guess it's you can't make an arrow of the thing on the bottom. You could. Because I, if you did, then you could get rid of the compass and it would be more... Is that what you were talking about? Because yeah, I wasn't yeah. listening to you. <laughs> you're, you're taking my idea I, I was, as I, something new I, in I, your brain. Yeah, I was, I, was like, I was like figuring out the same problem you were, but yeah. Oh, there's... I guess we got to turn it up a bit. 
hear the robots. Because I wasn't really hearing them. Maybe we'll turn it up on for the audience as well. Some games are quieter and some are louder. Oh! Oh, you got, got him. him. Okay, good. There is a sound... I didn't hear the robot. The, there is a sound change that tells you you got him. Yes. But I don't hear them sneaking up. They're very or the, quiet. the absence of sound. <laughs> like, you can tell he's dead. Yes. Because you can no longer hear his heart beating. <laughs> his robotic metallic, heart. <laughs> cold, metallic heart beating. Your eyes are so goddamn bright. Oh, I got the key. Or I had... Nope. I got to you shoot got it. it. I know there's a massive key. That's That it's, means you have the key. Yeah. It definitely lets you know you have the key. Yeah. Which is nice. Now I have to shoot another dude for the exit? No, you have to find the exit now. Just and find it. And you have it. to get close and it'll start flashing. On the bottom. Okay. So well, the, the spot will start flashing just like the key will start flashing if okay. you've found the key but not So I should just out. race through the map and... Um, do the edges. There's a big lag between comments being posted and showing in your overlay. Yes, there is. Well, that one just showed up very quickly. And that one. That one was immediate. No, super, oh, that's oh, on our screen. That's on our screen, yeah. It's yeah. like 20 seconds. Yeah. And it depends on the internet. Depends uh, it says on... outer perimeter for exit. Okay. Depends on the internet. Depends on... Um, the buffer here with the internet depends on Twitch as well. Ah! Oh, there's, there's something the flashing. Exit. That's the exit. Or not? No, it means the exit. And I have to press the button on it. Level two! Woo! Woo! Out See, of you were there one 24. time. You were there one time and then oh, died. Oh, yes. After five, we just didn't quite get through the door. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. So the map is totally different now. Was the map exactly the same each time? No. No, I think it was random. different. I think Randomized. it was different. Because that notch up there uh, wasn't on mm, all of them. Yeah, okay. But it was on this one and the previous one. So That's interesting. <clears throat> Not bad. Uh, there's not many 3D games for the 2600. With, um, yeah, just 3D in general. It's not many, many, many games. So is that the key? Because I killed somebody, I'm guessing? Oh, uh, yeah, I think that's the key. There you go. There we go. I'm getting better. And understanding the outer it. perimeter. Now I just got to search. We have to, you don't have to hit the outer perimeter. There we go. There you go. Level three. Okay. All I think. Right. I think we figured out this game now. <laughs> there's, you there's, found the exit. There's the exit. So it's not flashing because I don't have the key. Because you don't have the key yeah. yet. Okay, so now I just need to hang around here, kill some baddies, and uh, then I'm on my way. If I just back myself into a corner... Then you have nowhere to go. You can't run away. I, I never usually want to. Do they always come to you? Maybe I'll just patrol this little section down here. Oh, there's one. Come on. Yeah, strafe just... to the side and get him. Ah, yes. So you, when you want to strafe, you're already in position to shoot because you're holding the trigger button and then you just pull back and it shoots. Ah, yes, that's right. Yeah. That's, that's how I got a good tactic. Them. Twitch has a delay, always does for everyone. It's how they do it. Yeah, because the internet goes like up and down. There's a buffer on my side so that there's not an issue in like freezing. And then there's a buffer on Twitch so it passes buffers very back and forth and, and lowers and raises so that there's no um, issues. What is the t -t -t noise? Is that, I don't that know. doesn't sound like it would be intentional. Ah! What? If they're behind you, you can't see them. They just start beating you. <laughs> That's right. So that noise is helpful, except I'm near death now. Four out of ten health. And it's funny that the health is 
shown. Oh god, what's that? I was That's wondering the key? like if you Well maybe ah, when you finish ah, maybe when you ah. finish your score is your health plus a bonus. Uh could or something. Be. But I don't know. That's why. a lot of numbers on the bottom for a hundred health. Yeah. Yeah. Um, did you get links to where's my pancake? Uh, yes, I did. Sorry, I haven't been able to get back to you. Thank you for the link, I suppose to. And Lord Monkus, partly because of the buffer, it also to help competitive gamers from being stream sniped. Yes. Yeah, it's a little bit different for broad. Oh, yeah, stream sniped. Um, yeah, so they build in a big buffer because people play multiplayer games. Mm hmm. And, and then they see you, that they're playing on your game and like, they find oh, you yeah, and they yeah. know where you are. And yeah. they go, boom! Yeah. So yeah. it should be configurable then. Yeah. Good plan. I will look that up. Mm -hmm. um, not now. Not now. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to check out the buffer length, but I, I thought it was like 20 seconds. Mm. Um, last time I checked. So very, uh, very cool. Very interesting representation yeah, yeah. of 3D. Yep. I, th I think you could get rid of the top area. And change the bottom one into an arrow to show which direction you're pointing. Quite that would easily. Be, that would be easier for me. Yes. If you could do that. Yeah, because then you have, having to look the compass. you have to look in three places. It's kind of cooler to have the compass, but it would actually be... It would make it easier to understand what's happening yeah. to have it all in one place instead of looking in three yeah. places. Yeah. yeah, then you only have to look in two places. Yeah. You can make the 3D area bigger. Yeah. Which would be cool. Not necessary. Maybe it's too hard to draw the the enemies bigger. Um, How about this? Just have the map at the bottom rotate. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, yeah. no. No, do that. Do that. So the map at the bottom is rotating, so it's always pointing up. Yeah, but it's your... too... No. Unless it was square. I assume that that would be too... I suggested it because I assumed that that would be ridiculous That's... and impossible to do. Not because I think you should do it. Be hard Just to, to be clear, sometimes... Hard to do it because I know lot, I'm being an idiot. There's a bunch of math involved for yeah. Matrix math. And it would be just a bit of a pain. <laughs> He's laughing. <laughs> He's like, ha, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, let's get out the third game. Fall down. Run! There we go. Cover up Darcy's face. There we go. That's a good one. <laughs> See, if I look away and I cover up your face... Hey, uh, it actually went to your face. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Easily excitable. <laughs> and this is a two-player. Well, it's one and two. What is happening? Do you need me to do it? It is not accepting the cartridge. Okay. Now, the way these cartridges work <laughs> is that there's little prongs. Can you look away? I'll cover your face. Little prongs. See those two on the side? Yeah. And then there's little prongs inside of those. And on the Atari, the little ones go inside and push so this opens up. Right. But it is misaligning somehow and not doing that. I'm going to manually do it with a screwdriver. I'm going to make a sort of bird thing that if it was a shadow, it would look like a giant bird instead of just my hands. <laughs> and then there's... Um, what is this? Hit it with a hammer. Woof, 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 I could woof. hit it with a hammer. See, so... There you go. And, ooh, that is not opening up all the way. It's going down like a, a tiny, tiny bit. Oh my god. Yeah, it's it's uh, like the board isn't set properly. The board is, is uh, miss. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but you can feel the board's loose, and that's the problem. Ah, uh, now so... how am I? If I can keep it down there and then put it in. Do you have gum? I do. <laughs> in fact, I have gum. <laughs> I, was, I was only kidding, and hadn't realized you had gum. <laughs> <laughs> um, maybe gum. How could I jam that in there? 
See, now I've got it open. But it's a bit wiggly. Oh, there we go. But it is a bit wiggly. <laughs> Hide your face in shame. It's a bit wiggly, the board. Um, no. Uh, fired. That's it. Cat, you are fired. You're, oh, he's smart. He laid down in front of the door. Oh, I got it in. He knows I won't beat him. Okay. Even though he deserves it. He does for chewing on cables. But he has those pretty eyes. Oh, look at this. Oh. All my controllers Fancy. are hung up. There you go. There's a controller that isn't sticky. What? What? Why would they be sticky? Well, that the big one was sticky. Oh, I see. Oh, not <laughs> sticky in the sense that you're thinking. <laughs> like. Ew. Is it the beer? <laughs> yeah, it's the beer. It's the sticky beer. Thank you. Okay, there we go. And um, fall, <clears throat> fall Down does have voice, but since we're playing two players, we can't hear the voice. So, there won't be any voice. Uh, but we will play it single player so we can hear the voice. At yes, point. we will. Actually, I'll read about the game, and you can play it single player. Uh-oh. How about that? And have the voice in. And it decides, oh, I see. Ah, I understand why there's no voice. I get yeah. it. One second. There we go. <laughs> You're already playing it. Hit it with a hammer. Well, I didn't have to hit it with a hammer, thank goodness. Ah, uh, the computer is douching me. <laughs> oh, God. Which one are you? I've read. Hammerhead. Yeah, because he's like totally destroying you. No, he was, wasn't destroying me. I was defeating him sometimes. Oh, so, see, I'm ahead of him now. Suck it. <laughs> oh, but now I'm sucking it. So, Fall Down by Aaron Curtis, 2006. Let's get the instructions out here. Oh, the computer knows how to play and I don't. <laughs> he is a part of this world. He completely understands what to do. There's the manual. Oh, what do those Hi. balls mean? <laughs> we'll find out. Very colorful manual. There we go. There is another one. What? Page. Don't you flash at me, screen. Oh, I got one of those okay. balls. Oh, bugger it. Fall down pits the ever opposing forces of red and blue. Against each other in a frantic battle to capture... Ah, I lost! Capture scrolling platforms. That's you? No. No, I'm red. The wow, first player so to fall past to the platform oh, capture, my. captures it and scores a point. Taking time to collect ah, power-ups ah, can, ah, can give some advantage, <laughs> but taking too long only results in death at the top of the screen. But only temporary death, because then you come back. Yep. Watch out, because the longer you survive, the plat faster the platforms move. Which you are experiencing now. Oh my, what the hell? You can jump. By accident <laughs> or on purpose, presumably. And here's the controls. Jump is up. Use, I don't understand how he got so many more points than me. Use power-ups as button. Oh. Mo move left, move Why right. Why would you jump? Oh, to get over the other guy? Yeah. Yeah, but not yeah. when the computer... The computer's always going the right way. <laughs> Can't get ahead He's a of cheater, him. cheater. And also, I suspect he eats a lot of pumpkins. <laughs> um, okay. Jumps are proportional. Tapping lightly results in a short jump. Holding it up jumps much higher. Oh, God. And you're almost off the screen. Oh, miraculous. Come back. There's no miracle about it. It's just <laughs> straight up skill, y'all. <laughs> No, no. Down the hole. Down the hole. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, red platform. Uh-oh. Um, so game reset. Oh, I, you know, I did not get Should there that not? it was. Whoever goes down first gets the point. Is there no voice? Should be voice. Tari oh! Tari oh, Box my God! In. No! Mine! Mine! Get away! 
I don't know how to play, but... No! I was just trying to survive. I didn't know there were, like, points involved. Of... Oh, I hate this game even more. Even though <laughs> I, I, I like it. Should be voice. Should be voice. Of course, we can't hear it, because otherwise we feed back, because it's going through the mixer, which is attached to the speakers. And then the microphone goes back through, and we hear the microphone, hear the speakers through the microphone. But uh, oh no, no! Screw you, computer! I hate you. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> um, I didn't realize I was back in it. So game reset restarts the game. Game select returns to title screen. You can pause the game, and unpause it. Color black and white. Left difficulty, wrap around, right difficulty, closed. No, no, okay, I object to jumping existing, it's just there to screw you. So we had it on... <laughs> right, the computer's not jumping. So we had it on pro level. Oh, no, this is pro level. Yeah, yeah, wrap around. Oh, God. So now you can go left around the screen and keep We playing. had been doing that. Okay, one second, yes. Yeah, I would have done. I would have done much better if we couldn't oh, wrap can't. around. No voice yet. Why isn't there voice? When does the voice come in? Ah. No. Check. Check. No. Now it's on hard, and you can't loop around. You. You changed it. No, I didn't. Uh, yeah, because I used to be able to loop around. Now I can't. Oh, oh, oh. I, there's a cool echo where I sound super cool. Hello. Hello, Vancouver. Hello, the whole world. Uh-oh. Check. Check. No! No! Well, I apologize if there's no voice. Um, hello, Mayo Mayo Games. Welcome no. to the stream. But uh, yeah, the cat walks across my mixing board, so sometimes oh. buttons get pressed, and there's like a thousand buttons on it. So we may not be hearing the voices today. Okay, so you can read out from that page, and I will plug in the second joystick. Game modes. One, human versus AI. Two, human versus AI easy mode. Three, human versus AI advanced mode. Four, human versus AI pass by mode. What does pass by mode mean? I don't know. Oh, you can pass through them. Oh. Hmm. Human versus AI, five is human versus AI invisibility mode. So that means what? The computer, you can't, can't see, see the computer? Or you can't, yeah, I guess. Six, single player. Seven, human versus human. Eight, human versus human advanced mode. Uh, Nine, human versus easy. human pass by mode. 10, human versus human invisibility mode. So nobody can see each other? <laughs> yeah. Just close your eyes and play. You can't see yourself either. That's going to be hard, actually. <laughs> Maybe you can see yourself at points. Certain points. Easy mode makes the AI somewhat less effective. Advanced mode greatly increases the starting scroll speed. Pass by mode allows players to pass through each other instead of bouncing off each other, as in other game modes. Invisibility mode alternates the background color, making one of the players invisible for a short time. Okay. Occasionally, you can time. collect power-ups, which are then displayed under your score. Pressing the fire button will then activate all of the power-ups you've collected, the resultant all effect of... depending on the amount you have. Okay. One, gives a short speed boost. Two, yep. digs a hole in the platform beneath you. Ooh, nice. Three, gives a long speed boost. Okay. Four, in two-player mode, swaps places with the other player. Mm -hmm. In one-player mode, teleports to the bottom of the screen. Huh. Wow, those are nice power-ups, all of them. Yep. One, especially against the AI, a useful tactic is... Oh, gameplay tips. Yes. 
Number one, especially against AI, a useful tactic is to run into your opponent repeatedly, preventing him from moving forward. If you do this with a hole behind you, you can drop into it just as the platform is scrolling off screen, forcing the other player into a tight situation. Mean! <laughs> <laughs> Two, while your opponent is falling, stand directly beneath him and jump up. This will make him bounce high into the air, giving you plenty what? of time to capture the next platform. If he's on top of you, you jump up? Yeah, you jump oh, and boop. fire him to the ceiling. <laughs> Three, the swap ability. Four power up blocks is one of the most useful useful against a tough opponent. If you have time, if you time it perfe perfectly, you can make the other player die immediately after uh, trading places. Four. So you just let yourself scroll off the screen almost, then mm -hmm. swap. When wraparound edges are enabled, always check if you can use the edge to travel a shorter path to a hole. Yeah, of course. The AI uses this tactic to good effect. Yes, it does. <laughs> Five. In invisibility mode, just because your player has become concealed by the background color it doesn't have to stay that way. A well-deployed power-up may have an illuminating side effect. Okay, let's play. Other stuff. <laughs> Fall. You go ahead and play. I had to play okay. against the computer sure. and look like a tool. Uh, Mayo Mayo Game says there is Fall Down 2600, but we could use a licensed Falling Down game now that I think about it. Could be a cool concept. Aha, yes, that's a mean move. Uh, game still displaying Nexion. Oh, oh, they called me out. Called me out on it. Other stuff. Falling Down supports Atari Vox voice module. Connect it to the right joystick port, and the game will announce the winner after each round. Additionally, Thank Fall you. Down will use the Atari Vox's store high score for each game mode. Fall Down is copyright 2005 by Aaron Curtis. Ugh. Email. I won't say that. <laughs> You have to buy the game to get his email address. <laughs> Label art and manual by David Exton. Uh, www.liveinabin.com Special thanks to Nathan Strum for the awesome character sprites. Dennis Debro for figuring out well, that rolling no problem. Albert Garuso because he's the man. And everyone else, Stella and the Atari Age homebrew forum. Woohoo! And the last page says Atari Age. Yay! That's all you get. Oh, up is jump, yeah, okay. And the yes. button is It is very ability. unfortunately jump. <laughs> so I was uh, to... This game would be better if there was a green player. <laughs> like three players? No, yeah, just if green was one of the two players. It's always red and blue. No, it should always. be. I'm just saying that I, <laughs> I don't agree. It should be green. Should have options. Yay, I've got a power up. I've got two. That means I can dig a hole. I'm mm -hmm. going to keep... No, I'll get four. And really screw them. Nope, that one's too far away. How am I doing? Pretty you're good. not You're not being embarrassed like I was by the computer. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No! The computer does use power-ups. Ah. But, uh... Pretty seldom. The only one I saw him use... Yeah, see, that's the setting that you said you changed <laughs> to on, but you had, in fact, turned not. it to off. Uh, do your power-ups go away when you die? I believe so. I don't see any power-ups. certainly do. I don't see and any power-ups under zero. his score, though. And Maybe. he just picked one up. He just picked another one up. Maybe he doesn't get to use them. He, I saw him dig a hole. Oh. When he was playing me. Oh, he almost died. I do see them under you, though. Yep, and he just died. Oh, and the game is over. Okay. Now it is time. Let me switch the difficulties to see if... There we go. Press the buttons. I am blue. Oh, uh-huh. Now it should wrap around. I just changed the... Oh, oh, oh. No! <laughs> uh, <laughs> My blind running has not uh, always been so great. Yep, now it's wrapping around. Good, 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 good. Oh, oh, you made me. Haha! Uh -huh. Now it is time for you to die. Or me. What uh -huh. just happened? Oh, I lost I my pressed name. the button, it made a sound. Uh, the game is over, by the way. I won! <laughs> the cats just ran away. 
I have to celebrate when I can, when I can. <laughs> well, thank you for uh, giving me that point. Pushing you right into and it. And the token. <laughs> I pressed the button, and it made a sound, and then I went off the screen and died. Maybe it takes time to take effect. Did you have all four? Yeah, at all four. Now, I thought I was going to be in clever. Oh, no, don't jump. And I no! was not being clever. Ha <laughs> ha! No. Little victories! <laughs> <laughs> Take them where you can. Oh no! Oh, I'm blue. No. I'm blue. No. And no. Darcy is red, and he's. Oh, he just squeaks in. <laughs> just squeaks in. Oh, yep. Yeah. Now I'm back in it. Oh, you can jump. Oh, I never thought about that. Jumping over the chasms. See? See what happened? Did it switch with me? No, it did not. It just kills you and uses up all your powers. So what is the... Oh, ah, what is the point of that if it's just going to kill well, you? Well, maybe the point is that you have to do it right and we didn't somehow. That is probably the case. No! <laughs> <laughs> no, don't jump! Oh. 23, 23! Woo! Losing. <laughs> not losing. <laughs> <laughs> it's what I'll take, buddy. Uh, Pixel was looking at me like I was some sort of weirdo. Yeah, I'm making it's noise. He ain't wrong. <laughs> oh, the gravity is so low. So low. I want to bounce you. Oh, damn it. Nope. Nope, you're not. Oh. <gasps> Digging a hole. How dare you use your power-ups. How dare I use them for something other than murder? <laughs> attempted Murdering murder? Yourself. Attempted murder that backfires on you? Like firing a gun at me and it just explodes in your face. <laughs> oh, ah. Terrible. No! Yeah. How about that? No! Boo! Boo, I says to you. Boo! So technically, you could win but die first just because yep. you have the more amount of lines because of points so you could almost force a game end by dying no no what happened <laughs> this is the game where red wins <laughs> no 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 <laughs> there you go. You're back. For how long? Oh, it's so fast. Oh, there's lots of holes. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I was doing so well, and then I wasn't. <laughs> ah. 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 No. No. Uh, uh, no, it's over. You beat me. Celebration over. Victorious. <laughs> I don't think the computer should get any high scores. And currently the computer does hold the high score. What? The computer holds a high score? Yeah. That 78. is funny. No, I, that's not right. I didn't get 78. You didn't get 78. No, I didn't. Not even close. It's definitely the computer. I saw it. I, saw I don't think I've ever seen a game where the computer can get the high score. Yeah. Right. I've never approved of a game where the computer no. can get the high ah. score. Ah! Don't accidentally press up. I know. That's what I was saying. That I don't the like gravity jumps. is so low. Come on. Back in the game. Oh. <laughs> Super speed. Oh, it goes for a little ways. Have you used that one yet? No. Whoa. Oh, you helped me push push me along. That was good. Uh, yeah, so I don't think the switching one works. No, it doesn't. Because I did it and... Ah. 
And it just flashes you and you made you made you fast, right? Yeah. Twenty-eight. Yeah, let's quit now. <laughs> <laughs> what is the advanced mode do to you? Uh just makes it faster it... to begin with? Yes. Okay, well that's not super fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, 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 no. Nope. <laughs> nope. My thumb is sore. It is already? <laughs> I don't you use these controllers. Tense. I don't use these controllers get at all. What? It just forced you on the screen and gave you a bonus point. That's right how it away. works. How the game works. Feel sorry for you. Uh oh. <laughs> you used your thing and then didn't. <laughs> didn't get it anyway. Yeah. Oh no! Beat me by a millisecond. to 48. Shh. <laughs> Eclipsing. Of course, I'm just like not even moving, falling down. Ah. Well, that was a waste. Oh my god. Nope. Both. Double death. 23 to 53. I don't even think that score counts. So, what is... So there's that. Mm -hmm. that is that advanced mode? The down yeah, arrow? Yeah, it just means it starts faster. Okay. But then there's another mode. Oh, yeah, the, uh, what is that? University pass by mode. Pass by. So let's try that one. Mm, no. <laughs> no? Yes. All right. So I can run right through you. No yeah, more bouncing. It's, it's not even two player at this point. It's just single, two people playing the same <laughs> single player game. Oh, that is. Yeah, you can't really screw over the other person. I mean, it does give you an advantage with speed, but like, there's no interaction. So we both should do Whoever better. No, you will do way. better because you're you have better control of your characters than I do. Well, in I don't general, have you will I don't, do better. No, in general, I will do worse because I can't <laughs> take it. I can't use pushing you out of the way or, or what have you. Like, if I get so ahead cheap, before... Cheap I have a 50... tactics are the only way you can win? <laughs> yeah, because I don't have joystick uh, skills like you do. It's a, just a fact. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Oh, uh, okay. Like, before I had another option. Now I don't. <laughs> I only did better there because uh, you were busy laughing at me. <laughs> <laughs> All you have to do is shadow exactly what I do. Which is harder <laughs> than just doing. <laughs> yeah, this is not as... Dynamic. Like, dynamic of a game. Mm -hmm. It's good for, like, beginners, I guess. It'd be a better beginner type. Ah. Okay, I just pressed the button and it didn't do anything. I don't think that works. Okay, this is invisibility mode. Now this should be... Whoa, where are you? Of course, you can't see where you are either. Right. How does that help you? It, it doesn't. It's not to help. It's to hinder. Ah. Oh, it's to hinder. Where am I? That's why I was saying that, like, you were so, still winning. <laughs> so how does it... Oh, when you when you start doing well, it puts you invisible to give you a handicap? I, don't, I think it's just back and forth. Oh, it is, yeah, because yeah. that didn't... This is terrible. Oh, my God. It's very hard. Very, very, very hard. Where am I? Oh my god. That's way harder. This is really frustrating when you're invisible. You have to just hope for the best. Hope that you... Because you can't 
skip over a hole by just running. You always fall down the hole. So at least there's that. Yeah. You just have to pay attention to where you are when you become invisible and where the hole is. And press in that direction. But then you have to keep track of timing of when you're falling. I think we nope. double died there. And not as fun. So it's the same. Except with... Yeah. We'll, we'll try the advanced one. We'll see what it is. Let... It is a little bit faster, right? Eh? Yeah. It does start a bit faster. No. Oh my god, it's almost game over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just survived. Keep on, keep on going. You can do it. Bring me back. Bring me back, man. No! <laughs> I was trying to end it! Because I had nine and you had eight. Oh, <laughs> good tactic. And... Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god. Sometimes going off the screen is closer to the hole than running towards it. Going off the screen. Oh, you mean doing the wraparound? Yes. Yes, it is. Sometimes I going in the completely wrong direction, mm -hmm. and you should be doing a wraparound. That's the same as like um, amoeba jump, where you try for a super hard jump when you should be just. Oh, you bounced me out of the way. I was perfectly lined up to. <laughs> Damn there it! Go. So that is not quite as fun, I guess, for advanced players. That would be good. It's kind of nice as an option of just you. Just a single player game. I think the normal has a nice ramp up. But I guess if you want a quick game, yeah, you could play the advanced one. It does shorten the game quite a bit. Don't, don't jump! I have not found jumping to be helpful at any point in time. No. no! See, it just screwed me. <laughs> By pushing you out of the way? Again. Is as an option oh. for a zero player game. Did it? I didn't see that one. Yeah, because the computer can play just fine by itself. And if you let it go without pressing anything... Oh, <laughs> too fast. I think it just gives you a random power. Because if you have three, you can't dig a hole. Uh, no, three is um, speed up as well. Yeah, but it says... I thought it gave you all the powers. Mm, no, just a speed up. I think it's a longer speed up. Because I thought it was a hole and speed up, but it wasn't. Yeah, but also you thought that four was a <laughs> screw the other guy and it wasn't. Yeah, I think that's a... Issue, no! issue with us not understanding it or well, I doubt it's a bug in the game. That would seem like a pretty big bug. Isn't it convenient how it spits you right out the bottom? It's kind of the point. Otherwise you wouldn't be able to prepare very well. You wouldn't be able to catch up at all. And it's a catch up mechanic. Well not it's a sort of a catch up mechanic. The other person gets a chance to if it put you somewhere else, it, it, how would dead. you how would you ever get ahead? How would yeah. you ever be competitive? You would. And the other person, by surviving, has already gotten the advantage of the the uh, oh. field to themselves for a while. Yes. Very cool. Uh, I want to play the computer because I didn't really get a yeah. good chance to play the computer. Does it have just a computer setting? No, it doesn't. But you can just let it go and it'll it'll just start playing. Which am I? Oh, now I'm red because I have the different controller. Yeah. He does pause for a little bit. Ah, I see. He doesn't run right away. I think he waits to land. No, he does mm. run. I think he waits until he can see where to go. Right, rather than centering himself a little bit. 
Oh, I just run in one direction that might give me a chance to get ahead if I'm behind. <laughs> if I get away from you, if I go to where there might be a place, and if it pans out for me, then I can stay ahead for a little bit. Mm. I'm not saying it's a good strategy. It's just the strategy that I've been using. <laughs> <laughs> My strategy is go for the center. Because that... I mean, it, it doesn't but, actually but if help you. you if you're running, though... Around. If you're running, then you get momentum. Ah, uh, yes. And then that's... you are already heading towards a, a spot. I think that's the key, yeah. is the running. But if you're running in the opposite direction... Yeah, it can screw you. Yeah. But uh, if you're behind... I like that. That was dumb. But if you're behind, then it... Uh... No, wrong direction again. Clunk. Come on, guy. Keep going. Keep going. Bring me back. He's not going to die on purpose. So I guess there's an advanced computer guy a setting that he plays a bit better. Well, you're in the advanced because you're not in easy. Oh, there's an easy. There's easy oh, where he doesn't play as okay. good. Yeah. Well, he's kicking my ass. Yeah, he knows the... Ex he never makes a mistake in no. going the wrong direction. Oh, he died. Amazing. I won't be keeping you alive. <laughs> I want to try the easy one. Let's see how easy he is. And how he changes his, uh, his patterns. Well, he certainly gets in my way. So far, he's the same. No, he has a had a no. He has a slight pause when he lands, even though he knows which direction to go. Mm. Yeah, he's not anticipating. Yeah. Of course, we're both close to the bottom, so it's really yeah, hard, to, it's tell hard to tell at this point. It would make sense if there was a little pause, because otherwise, what is he going to do wrong? Yeah, he's got a little pause, so he's not leading off. No, he falls straight down. That makes sense for a, an easy setting. There's definitely something, because before he was just like Okay, I'm gonna way try ahead. I'm gonna try the four. See, like... Oh! It did switch! Did it? You get to pick when to switch. You have to activate it and then press again. See, I tried that and it didn't do it. I, try, I did try pressing the button again. Okay. I'm gonna... I don't know. Maybe. If I get a chance, I'll try it again. I think that's what it was. Mm -hmm. But we were so close together, it was hard to tell. I don't know if I'll get another chance. Ah! Keep me alive, buddy. No! Keep moving! Stop the pausing. Oh, almost there. Yes, there we go. Oh. Ah. 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 <laughs> Swoosh. Okay. I'm going to try the four. Oh, that's the wrong way. Got one. Oh. Seems so slow when... You start over. Yeah. Why is it flash sometimes? Because uh, you're getting close to the top and death. Okay. And it might be flashing because you're both close to the top or just one. I'm not sure. Because <coughs> when you're both close both. to the top, it's like danger mode. Yeah. I think it's when it's both. Because I... S I was thinking, it's like, oh, one person's near the top, but it didn't do that for just one person. See, he's near, he got pretty close to the top. Okay, that's two. Oh no, it just flashed again, and I was down and he was up. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just one person. Three. Four. Okay, now I'm different color. Oh, it just takes a bit. Uh, it doesn't do so it right away. Yeah, so your timing has to be... You have to give it more time to do yeah. it. it. Takes a couple seconds. Done? 
Done. Okay. Good. Very good game. Yeah, it is. Yep. Um, it gets hard pretty quick. Um, but I guess if you use those bonuses to your advantage, like especially the speed up, if you keep it, keep going on the ones, yeah. um, you can keep up pretty good. Um, yeah, definitely a very good game. Um, what was the, let's just go through the games once more. So Carrot Kingdom, good start. Mm -hmm. I think the second level's too hard right away. I think maybe instead of two coming at you, one could take two hits, maybe, uh, rather than two, because that's really hard. Or, or keep them apart a bit more. Yeah, it's, I don't think, like, I think having two is the upgrade versus one target before. True. Uh, but, like, oh. the toughness that they that was there... That was um, the wrong screen. Like... <laughs> maybe make two that close to you be further down the level because like the first one is you have to do it perfect yeah <laughs> there's no leeway no and so the first time you encounter you them it's kind of hard instant death yeah i don't know three in a row i think is maybe excessive um i find it really really difficult sometimes going off the screen yeah it has an option for zero thomas you see Mappy plays on Flashback 2 with Cart Mod? Really? Oh, wow. Thomas, you see. You see? Plays on Flashback 2 with a Cart Mod. Ah, oh, they're talking above my head. <laughs> I know what a Flashback 2 is. Um, but I don't know what Cart Mod they're talking about. I guess there's a Cart... A Cartridge... Oh, the Cartridge Modification. A flashback two is like an all all in one um, uh, Atari twenty six hundred with built in games, and one of the ones that they released is an actual hardware emulator. It's or very close to a hardware emulator, mm -hmm. and people have been able to wire in a cartridge port onto it uh. to be able to plug in other games outside of those built in uh, games. Gotcha. So that's the cartridge mod he's talking about. And he's saying that Mappy plays on it, which is a very advanced game. Mm -hmm. um, See, 92, it, ju it just single player got 92 <laughs> in the demo. What the hell? Yeah. That's funny. Zero, And it shows the last score, which is 0 to 92. And the high score is his. Yeah. But he didn't play anyone. <laughs> but you can play single player. That's funny. Yeah, you can. So he's like... Yep, try and beat that one. Go for it. Try and get me. <laughs> I got 92 this time. <laughs> Even if you get a higher score, and I'll beat you anyway. Those ghosts are pretty hard in Carrot Kingdom. Yeah. yeah. But I did beat three in a row, and I was, I did do it twice. So it's not impossible. I think it just ramps up a little too high. I, think I don't know what comes after, so I can't say. Maybe it's perfect. Maybe it's the perfect difficulty because maybe it gets even harder. <laughs> Good. And as you said, you did get past them. They, yep. They were way too it. hard for me. <laughs> they were difficult. Um, and then... Nexion 3D. Yeah, that was cool. Good, good concept. Mm -hmm. I think it could... Um, he could add to it a bit more. Like, if he takes our suggestion of changing the block into an arrow... You wouldn't need that top part. You could just make it a smaller space and just have room for like the key, yeah. like a symbol for the key and but maybe if it's the name a, of the game or something. Um, is it a ri an original game or is it being made? Oh, he, he is it based on another game. He originally named it Berserk 3D, mm -hmm. which is uh, an arcade game. And is which, it supposed to be that game? Because if so, close. then it might have the compass, and that might be why he does no. the compass that way. No, okay. Berserk is just. It's just a, a maze, a 2D. Oh, okay. I think top I, I it, down. It sounds familiar. Yeah, I think I. You I can think... shoot lasers, and and the robots shoot lasers at you. They don't shoot lasers in, um, in Nexion 3D though. They just come up and beat you with Pummel a you, yeah. metal fist or something. And brow so, beat you with their brows bang, of. Bang bang bang. Yeah. So it's not iron. It's not a not close enough to be a port, 
So it's just a maze game with robots in it. Um, so what were you asking? <laughs> it, it, uh, was it being made based oh, on a game? We all figured so, that out. So yeah, it didn't have that a, compass. It's a single screen. Like, did, are it's you just, sure it didn't have a compass at the top that maybe no, you just, just didn't notice because you were... <laughs> No, I'm very sure there's no okay. compass. It's just a screen, you and the robots. In that case, then uh, maybe we'll change it. I don't know. Yeah. But I, I assume you would have thought of doing that. Major Havoc. Very welcome. Yeah, yeah. I would have thought, too. Not th Only got 91 this time. <laughs> Didn't oh, come beat on. High score. Step up your game, computer. <laughs> <laughs> um, but then he would have to expand something. Um, it looks like the mazes are pretty set. Like, that would be annoying so it could expand the view screen a bit more just make it just bigger around the edges or something um or separate the two center them separate them a bit so mm -hmm. they're not squished together give it a bit more room and change it into an arrow um and you wouldn't need the top screen even though it is it's cool it's just glancing back and forth are you done with nexion and on to the black candle Oh, he's talking to Major Havoc. I'm like, he's speaking in tongues. <laughs> I don't get the code you're saying. <laughs> um, I think he is pretty close to being done with Nexion because he had it on a cartridge last October at Atari age. So mm. I think he's he's like, this is how I want it to be. So I doubt he'll change it at this yeah, point. Yeah. The whole layout of the screen, that's quite a major Yeah, it's change. really cool too. Mm -hmm. So, um, And this game... Very simple concept. What he needs to do with that game is have the joystick not misbehave the way it was. Yeah, fix my joystick. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's just my joystick. I'll have to take that apart. Um, um, you're very welcome. Um, we're great. We are very great. Very great. No, he just said great. I don't. Don't put it above what he said. <laughs> Keep it at the level of all right, great. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I want to say what some upcoming uh, episodes are. They're coming up here. And we have a new thing coming up as well that everybody can help me out on. There we go. So next episode on the 4th, next Wednesday, is going to be part 3 of Anguna playthrough, full playthrough. Um, I did part 2. And you didn't ago. get through, or you did? No, no. it's a big game. Yeah. Oh my god, do you remember that? Game? Yeah, yeah, very cool. Mostly because I was mapping. I had to map the whole world out. Uh, it's over there somewhere. Um, actually, I'll find it. It's right. There. Ah. Because it was just too hard for me to navigate. Yeah. Everything. And where you got things. So, and this is kind of messy, and I'll have to redo it. Um. Oh, let me put it back so I can see and show people. So there, I was uh, making a map of Anguna. And something, uh, it's not quite lined up there, so I have to redo that side. And also include one of the, the middle dungeon. You can see there. It should be in that spot right there. So I have to transfer that over. Um, so I was doing a lot of mapping last episode, so most of it was mapping. People got really bored of it. <laughs> they all left, but that's fine. Greatest. We're the greatest. Mm. He's upgraded us. But we did make a big deal out of it, and then he felt bad for us. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so I'm going to play playing part three, because I think I'm ready to go into the, the dungeon. Goblin King's and Lair. Are, so is it saved? Yes. Okay. Because I've got the save key in right. this time, rather than writing down the code. Right. And then the Friday after, we're going to be playing Crazy Balloon, which is up there somewhere. No, did I order it? Yeah, I did order it. Where is it? There it is. Crazy Balloon. And two more. And then we'll be doing a full playthrough of A-Star the next Wednesday after that, which is a puzzle game. Mm -hmm. We played it. Yep, that was fun. And then after that, we're going to be doing a new concept, which is games that maybe didn't get a lot of attention when they got put out. Like ignored, not a lot of people gave feedback on them. And we're going to pop them in and see why. 
and maybe give suggestions for those see people. why people didn't like like them or people whatever. didn't say anything about them mm. people didn't talk like chat about them um maybe they didn't get a lot of downloads or whatever and um and see why they didn't and i've got two on there one is pickle one is dragon racer trials of the worm and i'm still looking for three more and i know that arena foot gave me a bunch of suggestions but if anybody out there has suggestions Send them my way on the Atari Age forums or Instagram or Facebook or type them right here. Three in a row ghosts in Carrot Kingdom is epic. <laughs> okay. Yay! Um, and uh, then at the end of the month, there's the homebrew competition. And July's game is Draconian. And I'm not that bad at it. So I might be able to get in the <coughs> top three or four, hopefully. I came in fourth or fifth this month on um, Super Cobra Arcade. Somebody sneaked in at the last second and bumped me down to fifth place. And the guy who's running it is in first place. Do you think that's fair? He picked the game and, sure, you're, and you're running the contest. <laughs> I don't think it's fair. It's fair, yeah, it's but cheating. I don't know if it's wise. Uh, just yeah. noting that the computer is up to 97 as its high score now. Yeah, let me put that back on the screen there. Look at that. 97. Can he make it to 100? Should we just sit here and watch him? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> watch him play. Um, so those are the um, upcoming... Uh, episodes and i do list them in the atari age forum under homebrew discussion just look for search for zero page homebrew you can see the games coming up and you can make comments or whatever there and so that's about it for today friday thanks for hanging out everybody mau mau games uh i supposed to major havoc thrust 26 lord Monkus, uh Suinator? Su Suinator. Suinator? I think that's how it is. Because he did uh, phonetically spell it out. Because I was like having trouble with it. Uh, Dan AVC. And uh, I think I got them all. Thrust 26? Did I say that? Yeah. And thanks for. Thanks to Atari Cat here. Oh no. Is he on the screen? Not his quite. Top of his ears are on the screen. Right. There he go. is. Roar. Thanks, Atari Cat. <laughs> <laughs> yes, his name is actually Atari. Yes. I made sure Spiceware made the score go to a million digits. Although I doubt anyone's got that high yet. Oh my god. I doubt it as well. That's for um That's for uh, Draconian. Yep. But it's a fun game and I do pretty well on it, so we'll see. We'll see. So thanks for joining us. Uh, see you next Wednesday um, for another edition. And um, have a good, yeah, rad. Have a good weekend, Mau Mau Games. See you next time. Bye-bye.